all right so in this video i'm going to show you two most important thing number one is creating more users and number two is setting up the profile picture which is kind of tricky in google workspace account so we already have the admins account which is on an other eight example hub.com which we created in the previous video and now we need to add two more users right so in order to add more users what i can do is i can click on add a user over here in my admins dashboard i'll click on add a user and this will show me an uh, interface like this so i can just name it as mark d let's just name it this and secondary email if i want to put anything i can do that but as of now i'm just going to keep this what it is and then here it's also asking me to put the pictures and all the stuff but the thing is um, either you can put the picture from here or you can allow the users to put the picture on their own so if you want to set the profile picture from here itself you can do that and here it will uh, automatically create a strong password and it will send it to whatever gmail account you'll say but as of now i'm just gonna create a basic password over here and just name it password I'll just name it as password and add a new user right so this is the new account that I have just created and just like this I'll be creating one more account so mark I've already created now I'll create John D and yeah create the password I'll just keep it as password and this time I will not check this ask users to change the password right so uh, let's let's put something else password okay add new user all right so I have created another user as well over here which you can see just this one and now what I need to do is I need to set up their profile picture and in order to do that you will first have to enable this you'll first have to allow users to do it so the way you do it is you search for profile edit and here you can see profile editing when you click here you need to allow the users to change their name photo gender whatever they want so I can just uh, I'll, I'll just enable all of it and I'll click on save right so that's how you enable for users to change the profile picture and then I'll go back to home now I've created three accounts over here and now what I need to do is I need to log in with each and every account to see if uh, the accounts are successfully created or not I'm just gonna take one exam uh, one account as an example I'll open my incognito tab and I'll open mail.google.com just to show you whether my account is successfully created or not so this is john at the rate examplehub.com and we'll put the password over here that's it as you can see the account is successfully created right and if i want to change the picture i can do it from here click here to update your profile picture by default this is not going to be enabled but the process that i showed you earlier is how you will be setting up the profile picture for john's account and that's the exact same thing we will we'll be doing for mark's account as well and setting up the profile picture is very important to get more visibility when we are sending emails to our potential prospect uh, they will consider us more uh, authentic if we have our picture set up so make sure you have set up the profile picture for all the email account that you just created so that is that's it for today in the next one we'll discuss about how do we connect these accounts with Romeo organic